An animal rescue group made its way home to South Jersey today, marking a special trip. Animal Aid out of Marlton brought home its 25,000th rescue. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo was there. A caravan of canines all inside nearly a dozen vans in this truck pulled into this driveway in Marlton Sunday morning, ending a nearly 16,000 mile round trip to rural Georgia. That's where volunteers rescued more than 270 abused or abandoned dogs. You want to run, don't you? Yes. You need a lot of love. And, and what's amazing to me is these dogs have come out of the worst conditions, and they're so happy. You'd think they'd be unapproachable, and they're like, oh, my goodness, love. You ready? <laughs> Animal Aid is the nonprofit that organizes the monthly trips, but this is the group's 100th trip, culminating in 25,000 rescues since Animal Aid started in 2011. It's exhausting physically, mentally. Um, people ask us how we keep doing it, but you take one trip down there and you see the conditions and the mentality, and then when somebody asks me, the answer is always, how could you not do it? Still, volunteers with Animal Aid admit the work never gets easy. It's a frustrating battle for sure, but it is a worthy one. And after getting medical treatment, most of those dogs are placed in foster homes or non-kill shelters in the tri-state area. In Marlton, Matt Petrillo, CBS3 Eyewitness News.